if you qualify for this process, it is such great news because that means that you do not have to leave the United States in order to obtain your green card. Good morning and good afternoon. My name is Jaciel Figueroa. I'm the director here at Freedom Immigration and I have about 10 years of experience and today I'm going to help you understand a little bit more the new parole process that is going to be taking effect this Friday, August 16th of 2024. I'm gonna read it right off of the immigration website. This is, this is some really good news. It says here that the Department of Homeland Security, also known as DHS, announced a key step toward fulfilling President Biden's commitment to promoting family unity in the immigration system. The Department of Homeland Security will establish a new process to consider on a case-by-case -case basis, request for certain non-citizen spouses of US citizens who have been continuously physically present without admission or parole to the United States for 10 years or more. So this is the first point here. We see that this process is for people who have been inside of the United States for 10 years or more and people who have entered without admission or parole. In other words, people who have entered illegally into the United States, okay? The next point I have here is that they have no disqualifying criminal convictions and do not pose a threat to the national security of the United States. So the second point is that you cannot have any kind of criminal convictions or any kind of criminal history for that matter. Here we have the next point that are otherwise eligible to apply for adjustment of status and merit a favorable exercise of discretion. So for that third step, you need to be legally married to a US citizen, okay? So those are the three main steps that you need in order to be able to apply or qualify for this process. So let's go over them again. The first step is being here 10 years or more, having entered illegally, having no criminal history or criminal background, and be currently married to a US citizen. If you qualify for this process, it is such great news because that means that you do not have to leave the United States in order to obtain your green card. We're gonna continue here, it says, if paroled, these non-citizens will generally be able to apply for lawful permanent resident status without having to leave the United States and be processed by a US consulate overseas. DHS estimates that 500,000 non-citizen spouses of US citizens could be eligible to access this process. On average, these non-citizens have resided in the United States for 23 years. Approximately 50,000 non-citizen children of these spouses are estimated to be eligible to seek parole under this process as well. So there we see that if paroled or if approved for this process, you would be able to apply for your green card application being inside of the United States. That means not having to ask for a waiver or having to leave to the embassy to obtain your green card, which means it's going to be economically cheaper for you as well. Also, we see that it's not just for the spouses, but it's also for the children. So it's a whole family process and uh, beneficial to the whole family. So if you need help with this, or if you know someone who needs help with this, please give us a call quickly, because as soon as this August 16th date comes, everybody's going to be applying. And like it says here, it's about 500,000 non-citizen spouses, which means the quicker you apply, the quicker you're going to be able to obtain your green card. If you wait too long, all those 500,000 people are gonna get in front of you and it's gonna take longer. So if you need help with this, give us a call quickly at 407-910-4770 and we're gonna help you obtain what you've always deserved. Thank you and have a great rest of your day.